Hello, welcome, Cabbage here. In your reincarnation, let's have a look at the Fate board for Shadow. And then we'll look at my clears of 8, 9, and 10. Uh, I will not show the builds, uh, except for the last team. That will be at the very end of the video. But uh, I can explain what's going on here. Uh, but I am using my favorites for the uh, PvE content. And then I'm trying to use as many like status effects as I can. Status effects and healing. But uh, this is a versus uh, dark stage. Uh, light weapons, they're better at healing rather than uh, status effects. So uh, Demas, he has the healing gun. That's uh, standard pool. And then uh, Leon has the uh, dark memory staff. And 063Y has the uh, healing greatsword from Bloody Akeha. So, three healing there. <laughs> and then uh, Demas, with his character skill, has uh, blind. Yeah, I just put it on there. And I've loved uh, this blind status effect since the launch of the game. Abstract Demas has definitely been a uh, MVP of my account. Uh, there are other options, of course. Uh, there's like Abstract Lavania. And uh, the Recollections of Dusk, Leon, which I'll use uh, in a uh, future stage. But uh, Demas is very, very tanky. Lots of HP, so he's a great choice for PvE. And then uh, Dark Memory Leon. Still one of my favorites. Uh, he's Awakening 4, so his stats are pretty high. And then a uh, Regen uh, character skill. And then 063Y, of course, he is the main damage dealer. Uh, he has the uh, Poison character skill. I was really happy to be able to use him. And this actually might be the best content for him. He's also really good in Recollections of Dusk, of course. But uh, I can only use him once in a uh, floor. I always like to use the uh, kind of unconventional characters or strategies in the uh, games that I play. And then um, I often get comments, people saying like, oh, you recommended this character, so I tried it out and it worked, thanks. I have never got a single comment about Abstract 063Y in that way. <laughs> okay, so that was the clear there. Uh, next we'll look at uh, 9. And yeah, very similar here, uh, the uh, team composition. Uh, but Dark is better about status effects. So uh, Leon, he has the uh, Mechanical Leon staff to uh, put the blind on the boss. And then uh, Demas has the healing gun. I was very lucky to pull that healing gun. Uh, 063Y, he just has a, a great sword with a lot of HP. That's from uh, Anniversary Akea. And then uh, Blind, you know, it's not very reliable. It has a 100% chance to take, but whether they hit you or miss you, that's up to chance. So it can be kind of a uh, game of luck. But I've still found it useful enough to keep using it. And I am happy, but a kind of a little surprised that they still don't make any bosses immune to poison or blind. Once they do that, I'm in trouble. <laughs> but yeah, this team, it's not going to get you all of the other uh, missions. Like, um, don't use character skills a certain amount of times. That really shuts down. Abstract 063Y. Uh, or get over 500k damage, you know? Can't really combo with this team. Uh, but as I've gone through these stages, you know, it asks to use like a short sword user. I'll use uh, Christmas Gale or something. But actually I've gotten all of the rewards except for one black pearl and then one weapon uh, limit break thing. I've actually gotten most of uh, the rewards that it offers.
Oh, but getting back to uh, 063Y, I've never gotten a comment about someone saying that they uh, successfully used him. <laughs> uh, but I do get comments saying that they successfully used uh, 3 Star Noel, who also has a, a poison character skill. I sense a bias there. <laughs> yeah, but this 063Y, he's also pretty good in Arena. I think he's a great character. And one of the more underrated in the game. Alright, Demis is looking a little dicey here. Okay, there goes the boss. Oh, uh, stage 8 seems to have one of the harder kind of missions to clear, but I got the uh, all missions clear there, so maybe this team could be good for people to try. Okay, here, let's look at 10. This is the uh, solo fight against Demis. And uh, kind of a different team here. Uh, but at uh, once we cross the 75% threshold, uh, Demis will uh, start charging a very strong AoE attack. So for that, I'm going to use my two character skills. Uh, Recollections of Dusk Leon will blind, and then Anniversary Griff will break the attack. And we'll see if we can live through this. Okay. Even with all of the breaks, 80% attack break, 150 K damage. But that's the most uh, threatening attack of this fight, so we got through that. Uh, but here, this is another versus dark battle. Uh, so 063Y again using the healing greatsword, Griff using the healing gun, and Leon using the healing staff. And I didn't use abstract uh, Demas, because I felt weird doing Demas versus Demas. <laughs> so I took him out, and then I replaced the Leon with the Recollections of Dusk Leon, who has also a blind character skill. And then I was looking at my uh, light healing gun, and I was wondering who would be a good person to hold this. And then I saw Anniversary Griff, which I haven't used in a while. I think uh, Challenge Quests, maybe? It was the last time I used him, or some part of the tower. And then I haven't played in this way uh, for a while, where I break the attack and then kind of uh, tank the, um, the boss's attacks. So it was really fun to kind of revisit this strategy. And yeah, just overall, this entire Fate board content I loved. Uh, they did some missions to force you to play uh, manual, which I appreciated. <laughs> like you can't use companions more than twice, or can't use character skills, that kind of thing. And then also, um, I think these uh, the design of these stages really emphasize more tanky builds, rather than just uh, bursting, chaining, blow the boss away. So that was another reason why these were fun. In all the games that I play, you know, I love using tanks, uh, slow clears. So yeah, this was right up my alley. This content felt more like um, the challenge quests or the um, stray scarecrows. More than like Tower or Recollections of Dusk. I love all of it, but yeah. I especially enjoyed this. <laughs> uh, but before like any series attack of attacks, I'm trying to put in either uh, Leon's Blind or Griff's Attack Break. Just so that less damage is coming at me. And we got the clear! Uh, there's a mission here where we have to clear with a uh, spear. I could maybe sub out Abstract 063Y for 3 star Noel, although I don't know if she would have enough HP. Okay, here's the build 269k when the uh, recommended is 350. <laughs> uh, but, like Memoirs, just HP up, same for Debris. Uh, sub weapons are light great swords for that uh, bonus, and Leon same thing here. Just lots of HP. Zero six three Y is really the only damage dealer, so I can just focus on um, defenses. 
with the builds. And Griff with some light guns as the sub. And then some companions with uh, healing. Okay, that'll do it for this video. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you again. Take care.